Hello everyone. Welcome to Embracing the Actress. This is going to be the weekly love reading for the sign of Gemini. Send the love and light to all. Thank you to everyone that's like, share, subscribe. If you've hit the notification bell, purchased a reading, or if you've donated to my page, thank you so much. I do appreciate you guys more than you can know. I appreciate you guys helping me grow my channel. The more subscribers, uh, the more I can get the messages from Spirit out into the world. So thank you. Um, this message can be masculine or feminine. It can be about yourself. The person you're thinking of or your cross watcher. Take what resonates, leave what does not, please. Okay, for Gemini. Give me one card for Gemini, please, Spirit. Okay. We have the world and the ace of pentacles so you've completed a cycle okay you've completed all your lessons you now know what it is that you want from this life you know what you want to do right you guys could be trying to figure out or or you know just trying to yeah get to a place of starting a new foundation you guys may Okay, so Spirit says some of you don't know how this is going to happen yet, but this is where you are. You may have someone around you that wants to give you the world. You may want to give someone the world as well. You guys can have someone on your mind that, uh, that you're thinking about. Um, this person could be someone that you feel. You could have had the world with. What? Yeah. You've come through some heavy, heavy, heavy lessons that you uh, were given from the universe. I think that you guys have a better understanding of who you are, you know, what you want, like I said, the path that you want to be on and how you fit in this world. You guys may have spiritual fulfillment on your mind. You guys are really in tune with spirit as well. And you may be telling people or sharing how you're feeling with other people. But this Ace of Pentacles, like I said, this is a new foundation. You know, you guys may be about your money too, you know. Um, looking for ways, maybe you're looking for work, uh, ways of being prosperous. Um, you guys could also, like I said, be trying to build yourself a foundation. At the beginning stages of trying to piece your life together. I want to say at the beginning stages of piecing everything together. Could have a Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo on your mind. But I see this as you getting a new job, a new source of income, some sort of prize, some sort of windfall, a reward or something. Maybe you guys have 401k, maybe maybe it's a stimulus for some. This is definitely a new beginning. Something that you're going to have to move gradually with, steadily. It's definitely prosperity and it's definitely a gift from the divine okay so 
Absolutely. card flipped enjoy the bliss of holiday time together Gemini. anything else for Gemini? okay nothing else for Gemini all right so it says, enjoy the bliss of holiday time together. So maybe you're going to see someone that you care about around the next holiday. You could have shared a holiday with someone recently where it was very fulfilling to you and it felt like you guys had reconnected and um, were experiencing every you know thing on a different level and each other on a different level um, you could have wanted commitment with this person Gemini. okay could be gossip going on about this people could be speaking about it you could be speaking about what someone's done to you as well you also have guidance blessings answered prayers which means the divine is here and listening to you you've heard your prayers okay your prayers have been for someone to return to you this person that that um, was weak in a relationship with you they may have left you for someone else um, spirit of dummy they could have been being controlled by another person as well this person has walked away from you and you want them to return belonging guide and light and you looking out for them you're waiting out for them guys are up in your light house waiting for this person to come back the spirit is saying that this person has already left or that you have left right instrumental in getting you the spiritual knowledge that you now have and got you through uh, you know the less some of the lessons that you needed to learn for your spiritual ascension This person um, that you've been thinking about could be renting or borrowing a car. Could have some STD concerns right now. Yeah, they're out at a hotel, maybe seeing people. And it could be some sort of situation going on where the cops need to be called. Or maybe they're in, a, in, in the emergency room, someone's visiting. Anything else for Gemini? Okay. Someone feels like someone took advantage of them here. Sexually. Could feel like this person 
Okay. Maybe this person knows how to get what they want from you sexually, right? This person wants to come with a gift of a proposal. They may be thinking of this, right? You may have given this person a loan. You may have talked about a realtor or saw a realtor with this person. This person may be going back and forth to different people's houses right now, maybe couch hopping a bit. They may want to dedicate a song to you. Um, they're having issues with child custody and something may happen in October. All right, again, the next holiday, as per this holiday honeymoon card, would be, um, I believe it would be uh, Halloween, right? Hello, October. Okay. guys have movement, summons, fragment, and focus. Somebody may be dealing with something, someone with fire in their chart. Uh, someone could have a Sagittarius around them as well. Someone may, may be manifesting some things. And some of you may have been dealing with a person where you felt like you tried to piece them back together. Let's get the actual messages for these cards. We have movement, number 29, which breaks down to an 11. If you've been waiting for something, you will soon have clarity. You will get answers you never thought would come, and you will move closer to things that were out of reach before. Perhaps this card predicts a trip that you've always wanted to take. The symbol for movement can indicate both a change of scene and a real shift in the direction of your life. No matter what this symbol holds for your questions, know that wonderful change is now possible. This is your time to make your move, so that know that change is here in your life. Okay, you have the summons card, a number 13. Breaks down to a four. Now, how do you communicate with your powers or with the divine? Okay, now is the time to pray, to meditate, to acknowledge the sacred in every experience. Don't take your next step lightly. You have the power to summon your spirit, summon your courage, and summon the divine. You are inquiring about something important. You're thinking of something important, okay? Breathe and wait for a sign before you act. Spirit is telling you. Get in touch with your own inner magic before you make a move. You also have fragment. You are always whole, even if you feel fragmented. Even if times feel separate and fragmented, that is only an illusion. All the moving parts in your life are important. If the one you're asking about seems confusing, focus on one that brings you clarity. Be in the here and the now, and know that the divine loves you and sees you as a beautiful and whole person, regardless of how disconnected things seem. Remember to take a step back when you're trying to understand something. You may be looking at only one piece of a giant puzzle, a fragment of a truth. See the big picture through the eyes of the divine and no matter what, all is well. You have focus. This is a reminder that you must let go of all distractions and have the courage to give it your all. Your arrow will be drawn to whatever your focus is on, so keep an eye on your target. However, remember that you can't control every outcome. Just as the wind can influence the path of your arrow, there are many factors determining the course of your plans to achieve anything. You must focus, take aim, and let go. So Spirit is telling you guys to take aim, focus, and let go, guys. 
All right, you guys got this. You guys take care. Bye.